Hey there, my name is Gabe and I'm with API Nation and I'm here with Andrea from Mailbox Power. And today we're gonna talk about how KW agents are using Mailbox Power with KW Command. So specifically what we're gonna talk about today is just talk a little bit about what API Nation is, what Mailbox Power is and why KW agents are using it, how they're using it to generate leads, how they're using it to nurture leads, and then how you can kind of get in on it and get started. So give you a little bit of background on us first. Uh, my name is Gabe and I am with API Nation, like I said. And if you're not familiar with API Nation, we work closely with Keller Williams to connect a bunch of different apps to KW Command and other apps that KW agents use. So if you go to apination.com, you'll see a ton of different apps. And all this is, is just apps you can connect together, automate the work that happens between them so that when you add a contact to one app, it automatically gets added to the rest of your apps. That way you don't have to import them. You don't have to copy and paste them. And you can use that time to do like more fun things, build your business and not focus on kind of these minutia tasks. Um, so yeah, that's what we do. And if you're looking for our stuff as a KW agent specifically, you can go to the KW marketplace and just search for API nation, or you can search for the app that you're trying to connect. For example, Today, we're going to connect Mailbox Power. So you can just click that and it's going to show you. There it is. Let's set up the Mailbox Power and KW Command Sync. So speaking of Mailbox Power, that is Andrea's specialty. Awesome. Thank you, Gabe. I'm Andrea Shepard. I'm a certified training partner for Mailbox Power. And what that means is I can teach you how to use Mailbox Power to generate leads, nurture your current customers and use the system in a in a efficient and powerhouse way and so what we're about to show you are some key features inside of mailbox power so you can save time save money and spend more time building your business or hanging out with your family mailbox power has really cool already kind of pre-made off the shelf stuff, including like you can see baked goods here and it'll have the name of your client. There's gift cards you can send. So a ton of different awesome stuff you can send through Mailbox Power, but you need people to send it to. So the first thing we're gonna talk about is building that mailing list. And the mailing list that we're building is pretty awesome because you can do it custom. You can find the ideal people. Uh, it's pretty cheap. It's about 10 cents a lead for your ideal client, uh, which is, way easier to scale your business on 10 cents a lead than you know the 50 to 100 dollars a lead you might get other places um, and then we're also going to talk about kind of a cool strategy with fisbo expireds so that people actually read the stuff you're sending them so uh yeah custom mailing lists andrea how, how do we do that here okay so here we are inside of mailbox power and i just clicked on mailing lists over on the left hand side and i'm gonna just show you how deep you can actually dive into the system to generate these 10 cent leads to farm your areas. So you're gonna hit individuals here and then you can target uh, a radius around an address. Tighten that up all the way down to two, one point whatever miles, um, or you can expand the reach to you know a five mile radius. Um, then in the demography, you have all kinds of different options. Are they a homeowner or renter? Um, what their credit score is? Do you only want to talk to people whose credit score is 700 or higher? You can do that with this list builder. Are they married? Do they have kids? How many kids do they have? Do they have a dog? You could go on and on and on, but you can really hone in on who you want to speak to. Some of the things you would kind of filter by here would be like, what, if you're a specialist in like veterans or military people or their kids are just getting to the age where they're going to school? So there's actually, um, besides their credit score, there's their net worth, uh -huh. um, the age of the home they're currently in. So I think there's statistics on, you know, so many years after a family has or a couple or someone has purchased a home that they're starting to look, you know, ready to sell or whatever's going yeah. on. They had like the seven year itch. Yeah. <laughs> and you can combine these two together, like geography and demography. Like 
you you have that little radius you have and, to. and then you filter it yeah. okay cool nice so that's how you can generate leads using that mailing list tool you just order the custom mailing list it's got your ideal clients you can kind of you can kind of uh, play with the little settings there until you get exactly who you want um, and then it starts at 10 cents a lead uh, and then the fisbo expireds you can just buy a list of fisbo expireds and there's an integration inside mailbox power to bring in those people's Google Street View photo, which goes on their piece of mail, right? Yep. So we, you can print on the envelope on some of the envelopes in our system. So you could actually put a picture of the recipient's home on the envelope. You could put it on a greeting card. You can just put it on a postcard. Whatever it is you want to send out, you can add the Google Street View. And if you're unfamiliar with marketing to FISBOs or expires by adding a picture of their house instead of your picture and your logos and, and all the marketing stuff that typically goes on these mailers, if you put a picture of their house and your contact information, your phone will ring. We have uh, a ton of um, real estate agents inside Mailbox Power using it like crazy. And really, they don't want me out talking about it because it's their bread and butter are the FISBOs and expired. So anyway, Google Street View is a huge advantage because not only can you personalize it with their first name, myriad of other things, but you can also add a picture of their home and that's an attention getter. If I see my house on a piece of mail, I'm going to pay attention to Yeah, it. you're gonna wonder like, oh, that's what it looks like up for sale. You like see it on there and oh, <laughs> right next to a real estate agent's name. It's not hard to make the jump to seeing, you know, putting it up for sale, so very cool. <laughs> um, so that's generating leads, custom mailing list, super cheap. Uh, add that Google Street View picture to Fizbone expired pieces of mail. That way they read it, they open it and they they, they ring your phone. So once you generate those leads, uh, then the next step is nurturing leads, which is also kind of a specialty of mailbox power. Sending the direct mail doesn't just get you leads, but it's actually gonna push those leads towards deals. But the first thing you wanna do is actually get all your leads into mailbox power so that you can nurture them. So you get the leads from the custom mailing list, your ideal clients, but you know, your KW agents. You probably have been generating leads for years, uh, months, years, decades, and they're all hopefully in KW command. Uh, and so to nurture those leads and add those kind of to the fun, um, you're gonna use API Nation as the tool to get all those people into Mailbox Power. So like I kind of showed you earlier, if you go into the KW marketplace, there is a Mailbox Power and KW command sync, and you can go through and purchase it. Once you purchase it, it's $10 a month and it's always on, you don't have to ever check in on it or do anything like that. It's just going to make sure every lead you get from now on in KW Command automatically goes into mailbox power. You can even set up rules between these two so that leads you get or leads you tag in KW Command automatically go into a mailing list in mailbox power with special rules. So you could do stuff like tag somebody with popcorn in KW Command. And once you tag them with popcorn, they go into mailbox power and get put on a mailing list of people who are scheduled automatically to get a shipment of popcorn. Um, so you can do that kind of stuff automatically. So that's the first thing you're going to want to do. Sign up for mailbox power, which we're going to talk about in a minute, and then sync it to KW command to get all your leads in there. And so you can send them all awesome gifts. Step two is set up shipments. And then you said a lot of agents will plan based on a budget. What does that kind of look like? Or what's the process there? Okay, so over here in, we have automation templates. And so you can kind of choose from what you're trying to do. If you're trying to market to that list you bought, mm -hmm. find and engage, might be this category. But I want to impress and retain. There we go. Um, my clients, especially if I just closed on a house, right? So I'm going to go here. You can see all kinds of uh, options that show up, but what I want to do is stay top of mind and nurture these people so that the next time they're in the market, they are going to think about me. Not because I'm shoving a bunch of KW logos in front of them and my face, 
but because I'm sending them things like um, home maintenance tips or recipes or holiday cards, Valentine's Day, St. Pat, anything, any reason to be in contact with these people is um, an opportunity for you to earn more referrals and earn a lot of repeat business. So here's the ultimate closing campaign uh, or closing gift automation. But you can see how it estimates cost to send $194.33 plus postage. Um, and if you go to our that would be like, card and gift. But that covers your marketing for, is it two years, three years, 18? Is it 18 months? Two and a half years. So that's it. You and you like click that, they get set it up every quarter. Nice for two and a half years. Yeah. From you. They think you're like a rock star, yeah. right? So um, here's the entire catalog of things inside that you can send. So you can choose items under ten dollars. So you can choose your price range. Um, and just while we're here, see where those. Um, laser engraved charcuterie boards. So there's a barbecue tool set that can be laser engraved. Um, and here's a salad bowl. Here's the charcuterie board. There's all kinds of stuff in here. So you can narrow it down by cost to send um, and let your budget dictate what you send, but do send something. Even if it's just cards to start out, you don't want to miss the opportunity to take care of your customers. One thing, one thing I really like about this setup well, for the automations, like not only can you like click it once and then set it up and start sending, but I also like how it's organized here based on the function. So if you're trying to win back, uh, you know, a bunch of leads that you haven't been talking to her for a while, or if you're asking for a referral. There's special gifts for that that are already kind of drawn up if you're just sending a thank you. Um, so that really saves you some time. You don't have to, you know, all this stuff is already made for you. Um, you just have to, you know, click it, turn it on and start sending it out to the people you have as uh, leads. So those are the shipments and you can do it based on budget. You can see exactly what it's going to cost us. Put these people on a marketing plan. A marketing plan as long as two and a half years. Um, Even longer if you want. Oh, that's true. Yeah, you can just keep going with it. Yeah. Uh, you can put them on a few different plans. Um, and that automation is just kind of the tip of the iceberg. You can automate everything. So you can do that closing gift, birthdays and anniversaries. Obviously, you're going to want to put those in there if you have the information from KW. Uh, you can have that synced over. You can have that synced over to Mailbox Power and automatically have those people get birthday gifts, anniversary gifts, uh, which is like really charming and helps you stay top of mind on those days. And then once you have the shipments, awesome shipments, you've automated everything. Then step four, it kind of just happens naturally, which is you're going to create multiple deals from the customers you've worked with in the past. You can, I like this idea you kind of talked about, you can put the people who you work with, not just like clients and leads, but all the other people. So like painters, plumbers, the mortgage guy. Insurance. Yeah, guys from, you know, agents that you work with from related areas, you know, if you're getting a lot of people from a certain area. Get those agents on there and send them a nice gift card every so often. A Starbucks gift card when they send you a referral, just kind of a, hey, thanks for that. Um, so that's kind of step four. So yeah, step one, go to the KW Marketplace, sync up Mailbox Power to KW Command. Then you're going to grab some shipments, the ones you like, automate them, and then start getting those deals. So that is pretty much it. From here... If that sounded great to you, if you're like, yeah, this seems like an awesome way to build my business, less than 10 cents a lead, sending them gifts they remember, they're actually going to read this stuff because it has the picture of their house on it. Uh, from here, you're just going to go to buymailboxpower.com. And that is going to take you to here, here, where you can learn all about the special packages for you guys, KW agents as real estate agents. And then once you sign up for Mailbox Power, you're just going to go sign up for the sync from the KW Marketplace. And if at any point in this video, you thought this all sounds really great, I don't have time to do this, or I don't wanna kind of spend the time doing this, Andrea, that's that's you, huh? 
that's right down my alley. It's what I do all day, every day, is I help busy professionals get their mailbox power system set up and humming. So, so that you can stay and work inside of KW Command. You really don't ever even need to go over to mailbox power unless you want to add something new and then you can call me again and I'll set it up for you. But otherwise you're using tags inside of KW Command and it's triggering all kinds of automations in the back in mailbox power. Nice. So how do, if they wanted to tap you to kind of set it up and do it for them, how, how would they do that? Um, they could use the chat button in the lower right of mailbox power and they could ask for Andrea. Oh, nice. This guy over here. Yeah. yeah. And, yep. And they'll get um, all of my contact information um, and how to get a hold of me and we can go from there. Cool. We'll also put your information in the description of the video. So we'll have the link to this page for real estate agents with a special offer and then also the link to you. And they can just say, I like it. I want it to happen. I don't want to spend the time. Can you please do it? And just click that link. It'll take it to Andrea. She's going to do it all for you. And pretty soon people all around your farming area are going to get awesome gifts from you. They're going to be, you know, hitting you up, telling you how awesome the gifts are. And you won't even remember sending them. It's awesome. <laughs> Excellent. Cool. So that's it. Go to buymailboxpower.com. Click the link, sign up, sync it with uh, KW Command and you're up and running. Cool. Andrea, thanks so much for hopping on. Great talking to you. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Bye. Bye. <laughs>